last to compete in the singles round is Scott Rennick with his dog Rocky. And it looks like, well, Rocky is definitely set up to go out to the right. And away goes the dog. One wonders whether it'll go into the rough at the side. Yes, breaking into the rough, giving nice room. Well, that's good. That's good. Looking in. But short is still creeping round. No, it is not too bad because he's got to angle these sheep towards the fetch gates, not towards himself. So uh, it, it could be tactics, and that he's stopped at the right spot. Really, it's interesting to see how the judges mm, react to that. He may just knock a little bit off, but it's a good start, uh, a good lift, and the sheep are nicely bunched, coming in a straight line towards the fetch gates. and then all of a sudden they just slam the brakes on the turn round and, and turn around to just sway up the dog yeah has the dog got enough in it or well, have we got to respond to what he tells us to do now they could break sharp left but the dog's covering well coming very well the judges were very happy with the outrun 19 score just one point lost oh, very good and very good. for the lift great he's, got, he's just offline a bit now as he comes towards the pill so now the dog should be asked to look back now and he's going back and he's going back well this Ooh. is a brilliant start for Scotland it's a great start a great start that was a good uh, go back the other sheep are nicely in front of the uh, in front of the competitor and Rock is there behind the second lot of sheep so that's the second outrun completed and with good lift three points lost on the first fetch Good line here as well. A good line and a good pace. Wow, top marks for the second outrun and top marks for the second lift. Oh, well, is Scotland doing well then? Scotland doing very well. A lot of points in this competition, so they'll be pulling back dramatically here. And they're nicely on line for the fetch gates again. Very nicely through it, right through the middle. The other sheep are back on line, so things are going extremely well for Scott, uh, Rennick and Rocky. Brilliant. Great. Oui. Got to be up there with the points for these for this fetch as well. It's got to be top marks for that. What is yes, that? yes, he's he's doing extremely well. Now that there are ten, they might feel a little bit more secure and challenge the dog, but uh, they're they're all together now. They're coming towards the podium, they're coming towards the handler Scott and they've now got to come round him before they start onto the drop. 19 points uh, for the second fetch. He's only, he's only dropped five points so far. Oh, so that's, uh, he's off to a brilliant start now. Will he sneak out through the back? The collared you there. Interesting that it was a collared you that tried to break. Things that be going through my mind is well, maybe she'll break for me when I get to the shedding ring. But anyway, that's a fair way off. Yeah, let's get on with the drive. We're back on line, nicely bunched, and going in a straight line towards the first drive gate. Beautiful day, no wind, so the whistles are carrying well. And the dog's responding to both voice and word command here. See if they go right to the right as they go down the dip. They are doing so. They ask them to go around to the right, covers, and we're back online towards the first drive gate. Oh, that's beautiful. A dog that really knows what he's doing. All the Scots dogs are trained on everyday work. And a lot of sheep to play with as well. <laughs> It's about 2,000 sheep is left at home. And here we are, 10 rapids. Yeah. Interestingly, Scott started trying when he was um, 16, just after leaving school. Encouraged by a friend, no one in his family competed. But he's done well in the Scottish job. Nationals. He's been here in the last couple of years and, and uh, doing very well. And this is a good cross drive. This is a good one. They have to go behind the first hurdle and then they pull what we call pull back through the hurdle. Come on, oh, he's oh, rung them. Come on. He's rung them. 
This is where the dog can be slightly, although we've got it in, on, uh, on the camera here, the dog can go out of sight of the handler. So you could well have not seen the start of the dog coming round. So the judges will be penalising that. And what have we got? Uh, five, four, five have gone the wrong side of the of the uh, second drive gate. So there'll be quite a few points lost. That's been the worst part of the whole trial, really. Otherwise, it's been tremendous up to this point. Put that little moment behind him. Yes, he's got them settled again. Just coming slightly offline as they come towards the shedding ring, but uh, certainly the, uh, the dog's up to this job, no problems at all. And again, another handler that whistles uh, with his fingers. Now the sheep have got to come into the shedding ring before the handler uh, goes into the shedding ring himself. Notice that the dog was then, it looks as if he was going to look back to go for another pass of sheep then. But they're into the ring, and now there are three sheep with red collars on. And that is that the one that broke before. <laughs> Quick, get in there, Robbie. It went through my mind. That might be the one to go for, but there's another one on this end. 16 scored for the drive, that's 16 out of 30. It's almost, almost half his points gone. Shame really, after that very, very, very good start. Just hang it back up on there. But this is, I could well be the deciding factor on, on uh, this uh, competition today, the shedding ring. Yes. Oh yes, come on, come on, on to the dog. Have the judges going to accept it? I've not heard anything. I don't know whether the judges have accepted that or not. It looked like a clean shed. Um, yes, yes, but whether the dog held it to the satisfaction of the judge, see, the dog certainly came through. It would be interesting to see what the judges uh, do for this. Nine scored. They've accepted it. They're accepted. Now, can we get ten sheep into that small pen? So one second we're asking the dog to take one sheep off and now we're asking the dog to keep all these sheep together and get them into oh, that small pen. Go for it, good. Looking. Well, this would be a delight if we could just if they just trot in there now. Yeah, it should be a great room for Scotland. Yeah, because it does it, they're all still looking in. Scott slowly coming round. The dog poised on its feet, ears pricked, just waiting to come in or go left or right. That one at the back there with the collar that likes to do its own thing, let's just hope she's keen on up and looking that yeah, pen. If she stays in the middle, moving gently towards that pen. This is good. Oh, is the one going to go down the side? Yeah, just a little bit. Ah, oh, there's that colour you again. Bye, 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 bye,
chance. But she may well come round, Let's meet that open gate, and in she goes, and that's it. Round complete. Let's see what the pen has scored. Just four, and that brings a total of one, two, four for Scotland.